My name is Sergeant Major Instructor Stuart Patterson of the Army Physical Training Corps. The class behind me are all soldiers from different corps and regiments in the British Army. The class will follow my instructions, as I hope you will, as I take you through a regime of exercises designed to improve the efficiency of the heart and lungs, or in other words, develop endurance and stamina. Let's get straight into the warm-up exercises, which last 10 minutes. You can monitor the time by watching the stopwatch on your screen. In position for your first exercise, hands on hips. Exercise with me, begin. To the shoulders and look up and stretch up. Follow your hands with your eyes. Keep the exercise going at my speed. Good reach up each time. Make sure you follow your hands. That's good. Nice steady rhythm because we're just starting to warm up. That's good. Keep with me. Just starting the warm up now. Nice and easy. Stretch up each time, but not beyond what is comfortable. Nice and steady. Good stretch when you reach up. Shoulders look up. Follow the hands all the way. Nice rhythmical cadence. The next exercise is an arm swinging exercise with one foot forward. Exercise with me, change. And press and press. That's good. Keep it there. Arms nice and straight. Head erect. That's nice and steady. Not too fast. And don't press back too hard to start with. Increase the range as you get warm. Well done. Try and keep pace with me. As we slowly increase it slightly, that's good. And it's press and press. Good, well done. Press and press. Press and press. That's good. Keep the arms nice and straight. Press at both ends of the arc. Not too hard back though. Keep it in a pain-free range of movement and don't jerk any of the movements. Nice and flowing. That's good. The next exercise is a trunk exercise with your feet about hip width apart. Exercise with me, change. And down and up. That's good. Let the head curve with the body. Cut the arm up. Good. Allows for a little bit more movement. Well done. Arc the head over with the natural curve of the body. Keep the legs straight. That's good. Well done. Keep in time with me. That's good. Tuck that other arm up as you reach down for your socks. Well done. Keep it going. Nice steady rhythm. No need to go too fast on this exercise. Try and keep the legs straight. Imagine you have glass in front of you and behind you and you can't lead forwards or backwards. You must go over sideways. That's good. Well done. Don't press down into the movement. Just let your body weight take you down and relax into it. That's good. Well done. Warming up now so we should be able to get down that little bit further. Don't overstretch. Keep it going. The next exercise is marching on the spot. Feet just hip width apart. With me, change. Nice and relaxed to start with. Knees should be coming up about hip height. Arms down by your side. That's good. Nice and light on the toes. We're going to increase the pace slowly and then we're going to develop it into a little jogging action using our arms as well. Increasing the pace a little bit. Watch the screen. When we start to jog, bend the arms for balance. Stand by and jog. That's good. Increasing the pace a little bit. Nice and light on the toes. Keep it going. Well done. Heart rate, breathing rate, 
both increasing now. You might be able to feel it. Don't worry. It's natural, increasing the pace a little bit. Knees coming up that little bit higher. That's good. Keep it going. Use the arms to keep your balance. Nice and light on the toes. The next exercise is a neck exercise. Again, the feet will be hip width apart. Exercise with me, change. To the left and back, to the right and back. To the left and to the right. Nice and steady with this exercise. The next exercise is back to the arms. The arms start in the horizontal crook position. Exercise with me. Change. Reach forward and back. Reach forward and back. We're going to develop this a little bit into a coordination exercise. So we'll start by doing alternate single arm action. Starting with the left arm. Exercise with me. Change. To the left and back to the right and back. That's good. Reach out each time. Nice sweeping arc. That's good. Well done. Try and keep pace. Keep in time with me. Now we're going to develop this a little bit more and after every single alternate arm action we'll do a double arm action like we did at the start. Next time round so it's to the left to the right and both together. To the left, to the right and double. To the left, to the right and double. Keep it going. To the left, to the right and together. The next exercise is a gentle back exercise with me Feet slightly apart, change. And reach down slowly and slowly uncurl. Hands to your knees, to your hips, and then look up and reach up. That's good, well done. And again, down we go, nice and slow. Hands down to about your toes. That's good. As we come up, make sure you watch the screen and then you can keep in time. Good. Down we go. This might give you some sensation at the back of the legs. This is normal. But just go down as far as you can and as we warm up you'll find that you can go a little bit further down each time. Fingertips to the floor now and slowly uncurl. Chin up and arms up. Good. Try and keep your legs straight. Draw your hands up your legs chin off chest, watch your hands and stretch up. That's good. Down we go again. Should be able to reach just that little bit further now, perhaps to the floor. Keep your legs straight and reach up. That's good. The next exercise is the final exercise of the warm-up routine and is a swinging squat exercise. Your feet need to be slightly closer together. Exercise with me, change. Swing down and up. Swing down and up. Swing down and up. Swing down and up. That's good. Keep it going. Weight bearing knee flexions tend to be a little bit difficult on the knees. Remember, knees to 90 degrees only, no further. Make sure that your heels stay on the ground. That will prevent you going down too far. That's good. We slowly increase the exercise rate now because we're coming towards the end of the warm-up phase. That's good. Keep it going. Well done. Grit your teeth. That's good. Definitely feel the heart rate increasing now and the breathing rate. That's good. 
down we go, not too far, remember no further than 90 degrees even though we're increasing the pace, don't get carried away with the range of movement. Well done. Working a bit harder now, heart rate is increasing, certainly the breathing rate is increasing, keep it going. Good. Down we go. That's excellent, well done. A few more seconds, keep it going. One, two, three, four, class steady, halt. You now have one minute to take a short rest or get a drink of water. First, regain your composure. If you do decide to drink water, then sip it slowly. If you don't feel quite ready to continue with the main exercise regime, then pause your video until you are ready. Don't rest for longer than five minutes, otherwise you should repeat the whole warm-up. If you do decide on a longer rest, keep warm with additional clothing. Rest period over, and if you are not already standing facing the screen, on your feet, up. The first exercise is walking on the spot. Exercise with me, begin. Nice and relaxed with the arms by your side. Nice and light on the toes, bringing your knees up to about hip height. Nice and steady. Remember this is the main exercise program, and each exercise lasts that little bit longer. Watch the screen and pick up the pace. Lifting the knees, a little bit quicker, that's good. Nice and light on the toes. The next exercise is skip jumping. Your feet are very nearly close together exercise with me, change. Bend the arms slightly for your balance, that's good. Nice and light on your toes, increasing the pace a little bit, bending the knees that little bit more, that's good. Stay on your toes, well done. Just clearing the floor each time, that's good. Breathing rate is increasing slightly. That's normal. Keep it going. Try and keep in time with me. Working that little bit harder now. The next exercise will be a stride jumps. Keeping your arms in the same position. Exercise with me change. Nice and light on the toes. Don't go out too far. That's good. Pick the exercise up. Try and keep in time with me. Nice steady pace to start with. We can increase it as we go along. But remember each exercise is done for a little bit longer in this phase. Relax upper body, nice steady breathing rate. Well done. Start to feel the legs working now. Increasing the pace just a little bit. Don't go out too far. Good, well done. Easing off just a little bit now.
keep it going. The next exercise, we're just going to introduce the arm action so that our arms are going out to the side as well. Exercise with me. Begin. Well done. Pick the exercise up, watch the screen, try and keep in time with me. We're going well, keep with it. Arms to shoulder height only, head erect. That's good. Steady breathing rate. Light on your toes, bending the knees when your feet hit the floor. That's good, well done. Starting to work a little bit now. Keep that pace going. Well done. Coming up to the end of this exercise phase. Keep the pace going until we change the exercise. The next exercise is jogging on the spot, using your arms to balance you. Exercise with me, change. Nice and relaxed, just lifting the feet up slightly, bending the knees. Use your arms as you would if you were running normally. Nice and easy, just lifting the feet up off the floor, just, that's it, good. Working our way up a little bit, increasing the pace by lifting the knees just that little bit higher. Use your arms as well. Nice steady breathing rate. Relaxed upper body and keep your head up, watching the screen as we slowly increase the pace a little bit. Knees coming up a little bit more. That's good, that's good, keep with it. You're doing well, stick with it. And pinching in a little bit more now, increasing pace. Knees coming up a little bit higher. Well done. And increasing pace just a little bit more. Good, working hard now. Slow down slightly. Ready to change into the next exercise. Which will be skip jumping. Arms bent, nice and steady. Exercise with me, begin. Nice and easy. During this exercise, we're going to start lifting our knees up just that little bit higher every third jump. I'll count you down. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Nice and steady. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good.
Up higher. Use your arms for balance. Good. Next exercise will be scissor jumps. Exercise with me. Change. That's good. Keep it going. Nice and light on the toes. Upper body nice and relaxed. Well done. Keep with it. Increasing the stride length just a little bit. That's good. Keep with it. Remember to bend your knees when your feet touch the floor. It takes away the impact. That's good. Well done. Keep working hard. The next exercise will be a stride jumps with your arms going out to the side at shoulder height. Exercise with me, change. Good, well done. Watch the screen, pick up the timing, nice and relaxed. Arms up to shoulder height only and on your toes. Good. We're going to develop a little bit of coordination here. We'll now try our arms going forwards only. Exercise with me. Change. Good, well done. A little bit more difficult than the first one. Tends to throw you a bit. Watch the screen, pick up the timing. We're now going to introduce the side action as well. So the arms will be going forwards and side. Watch the screen, exercise with me, change. Good. Pick up the timing. If you're out of phase, don't worry. Stick with it and try and catch up. We're now going to introduce hands going upwards only. Exercise with me, begin. The final stage of this exercise will be a combination of all three arm actions, one after the other. So we'll be going sideways, forwards and upwards. Exercise with me, change. Sideways, forwards, upwards. Sideways, forwards, upwards. Good. That's great. Keep with it. The next exercise, jogging on the spot. With me, begin. Nice and relaxed now. Nice and steady. Low knee lift. Use your arms. This exercise will now develop. We'll increase the pace slightly. And then we'll be counting down from five. And during the countdown, I want you to sprint as fast as you can. Stand by. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. And slow down. Keep the pace going. Don't stop. That's the way. Well done. Watch the screen. Listen for the next countdown. Stand by. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. And slow down. Keep the pace on. Stand by. Go. 
five, four, three, two, one, and slow down. Keep the pace going, don't stop. We have one more five second to do. Stand by. Go, five, four, three, two, one, slow down. Nice and steady now. Slowing right down, all the way, so that your knees are just bending, toes still on the ground, and break into a walk. Arms by your side, just swinging as you walk. That's good. Natural cadence. Well done. Reduce your knee lift so that your heels are just coming up off the ground. That's good. Class steady. Halt. Relax, don't collapse. Stay on your feet. You've done well. Use this time now to regain your composure. If you feel more comfortable, put your hands on your hips so that you can breathe more easily. We are now going to do the cool down and stretching exercises if you'd like to watch the screen and follow the class. The first exercise is a shoulder stretching exercise in position with me, ready. Bring the arm across the front of the body, bend the elbow, that's good. Use the other arm at the back of the elbow. Don't press into the position too hard, just hold it in a stretched position. Across to the other side. Well done. This is stretching out the muscles of the shoulders. That's good. Hold the position. The next exercise is designed to stretch the muscles at the backs of the legs. Feet need to be slightly wider apart. Into the neutral position. And down we go. Bend the knees. Run your hands down the front of your legs and grip just above the tops of your socks and then extend the knees backwards so that your legs are straight bringing your head down in between your arms that's good, hold that position you'll feel it at the backs of your legs and now slowly start to uncurl running your hands up your legs to your knees to your hips up to your shoulders and stretch up and come back down into the neutral position Next exercise is for the calf, one foot forward, place your hands on your thigh, that's good. Keep your heels on the ground. Make sure that your feet are facing forward. It's important your toes are facing forward, that's good. Good stretch on that rear leg. Come back up into neutral and take the opposite leg forward, that's good. Don't bounce into it at all, just hold the position, support yourself on your forward leg. The next exercise is designed to stretch the thigh muscles out into neutral. Pick up one foot and press it into the buttock and then extend slightly at the hip. That's the position. You might need some furniture to support yourself. And now back down to neutral. Pick up the other side. Extend slightly at the hip, keeping that heel in your buttock. That's good. Well done. The next exercise is a trunk exercise. Feet slightly wider than hip width apart. And lean across. Good. Reach down for your socks. Let the head curve with the natural arc of the body. And the upper arm goes over the head. That's good. Back up through neutral and across the other side. Hold the position, class steady, halt, and relax. Those last five stretching and cool down exercises should be repeated, holding the position slightly longer. That concludes the exercise program for level one. Level 2 involves an increase of intensity of some of the exercises that you have already done, the inclusion of further exercises to improve your stamina, and the introduction of new exercises to develop your general strength. As with Level 1, we will start with a warm-up. In position for your first exercise, feet about hip width apart and arms held loosely at the side. In position with me, ready. 
exercise with me, begin. Swing your arms round. One, two, three. Watch your hands. Change. Round the other way, following your hands with your eyes. And change. And change. And change. And change. And change. And change. Class steady. Halt. Next exercise is an arm swinging exercise. Left foot forward, right hand on hip. Ready? Exercise with me, begin. Try and keep the arm straight. That's good. Try and brush the ear, keeping your head erect. Well done. That's good. Try and keep pace with me. We're going to change on to the opposite side. With me, change. Good, well done. Again, nice straight arm. That's good. Try and keep the pace. The next exercise is a trunk exercise with your feet hip width apart. In position, with me, change. Down and up. Down and up. Tuck that arm up underneath, reach down to your socks. Nice and easy to start with. Increasing the range of movement as you get warm. That's good. Reach down and up. Let the head follow the arc of the body. Nice and relaxed. We're now going to introduce double arm action, reaching over to the side. Exercise with me. Begin. Out to the side and back. Reach and back. Good. Let the head curve with the body. That's the way. Reach and back reach and back. Good, well done. The next exercise is skip jumping on the spot with the arms in the bent crook position. Exercise with me, change. Nice and relaxed. That's good. On your toes, bend the knees on impact. Keep it going. On every third beat, we'll open our legs up straight, doing a stride jump in the air. Exercise with me, begin. One, two, three. 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 Class steady. Halt. In position for your next exercise, shoulder rolling, left shoulder with me, begin. Bring the shoulder forward, nice and easy. That's good. And now the other shoulder. Straight into right shoulder, rolling forwards. Now both shoulders together. With me, begin. And now we're going to go back the other way. Exercise with me change and back good reach back feel your shoulder blades pinching behind you nearly that's good well done well done 
The next exercise is an arm swinging exercise with your left foot forward. Exercise with me, change. Swing forwards and back, forwards and back. Come up on your toes as you go forwards. That's it, good swing. Above shoulder height this time. That's good. Swing up, swing up, that's good. Keep with it, arms nice and straight. Rock forward on your toes. Good, roll onto your toes, rock back onto your heel on the front foot. Toes of both feet, reach up, that's good. Good arc with the arms, well done. You'll feel this in the calf group as well. Try and keep the head nice and relaxed. Well done. The next exercise is a shoulder and neck exercise with the arms in the bent crook position, feet astride, arms at shoulder height. In position for your next exercise, with me, change. To the left and back, to the right and back. Keep your elbows high, reach back and forward. Let the eyes follow the hands, that's good. Good reach round there. Follow your hands all the way round. Try and keep your arms shoulder height. To the side and front. Side and front. That's good. Keep with it. Good range of movement. Don't press too far back. Arms up shoulder height. You'll start to feel the muscle work in the shoulders as the exercise progresses. Keep them up. Don't let them drop. That's good. Well done. To the side and back. To the side and back. That's good. Keep with it. Nice and relaxed. Good cadence. Well done. The next exercise is skip jumping on the spot with the arms in the bent crook position. Exercise with me. Change. We are now going to develop this into a coordination exercise with the arms going out to the side first but keeping our feet together. Exercise with me, begin. Nice and easy, out to the side, at about shoulder height. That's good, well done. And now we're going to go forwards only, with me, change. Forwards, forwards, that's good. Well done. That's great, keep it going, shoulder height. And now a combination of the two, forwards and sideways, with me, begin. Side, forward, side, forward. Well done. Try and pick it up, keep your feet together. That's good. Doesn't matter if you're slightly out of phase, keep the pace going. We're now gonna go up only. Exercise with me, change. Reach up, good, up, up, that's the way. And now a combination of all three movements with me, change. Side, forward, up, side, forward, up, side, forward, up. That's good, keep with it. Side, forward, up. Side, forward, up. Well done.
across, steady, hold, stand at ease, relax. You now have one minute to take a short rest or get a drink of water. Take this time to get your breath back before we move on to the main theme of the session, which is stamina and strength. If you do drink water, sip it slowly. If you don't feel quite ready to continue with the main exercise regime, then pause your video until you are ready. Don't rest for longer than five minutes, otherwise you should repeat the whole warm-up. If you do decide on a longer rest, keep warm with additional clothing. Rest period over and if you are not already standing facing the screen, on your feet, up. We are now ready to start the main theme of level two. Remember we have introduced some strengthening exercises during this part of the program. In position for your first exercise, with me, ready. Exercise, with me, begin. Down, back, forward and up. 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 Bend at the knees, not just at the waist. Don't try to look up all the time. Steady, halt, in position for your next exercise, dorsal raises, front line with me, ready. <laughs> exercise with me, begin, up and down, up and down. Keep your feet on the floor if you can. If you can't, don't worry, but keep your legs straight. Breathe in when you raise up and out when you lower down. Keep the movement smooth and not too fast. Up and down. Up, good range, and down. Extend and down, up and down. You should be feeling this in the muscles down either side of your spine. Up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. And down. Well done. Up and down. 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 Class steady. Halt. In position for your next exercise. Skip jumping on the spot. With me on your feet. Up. Begin. Nice and relaxed upper body, on your toes. 
That's good. We're going to develop this a little bit so that we're going to be doing some side jumps across an imaginary line on the floor. At the moment, nice and steady, feet together, normal skip jumping. That's good. Well done. Starting skip jumping to the side with me. Begin. Nice and easy on your toes, feet together. Well done. Relax the upper body. Keep it going. The next exercise we do is a back extension pressing exercise on all fours. Watch the screen for your next exercise. Well done. Class steady, halt. In position for your next exercise on all fours, ready. Exercise with me, begin. Sit down on your heels, get your head low, come forward and push up. Sit down on your heels, head low, come forward and push up. Well done. Sit down on your heels, head low, come forward and push up. Sit down on your heels, head low, come forward as far as you can and push up. Good. Down on your heels, head low, come forward and push up. Sit down on your heels, head nice and low, come forward and push up. Sit down on your heels, head forward, all the way and push up. Down your heels, head low and forward and push up. Sit down on your heels, head low, come forward and push up, class steady, halt. Your next exercise is bent knee sit-ups in position with me, ready. Exercise with me, begin. Sit up and down, 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 and up and down, well done, up and down, reach for your knees and down, and reach and down, and reach and down, reach up and down, that's good, up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down and down, sit up and down, and up and down, and up and down, and up and down, sit 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 up and down, and up and down. Class steady and halt. In position for your next exercise, abductors, side lying on the left with me, ready. Legs straight, cock your toes, exercise with me, begin. Up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Developing this exercise a little bit more, we're going to swing the leg forwards and backwards, exercise with me, up and down, change, swing forward and back, 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 class steady, hold, legs together, roll over onto the other side with me, go, <coughs> exercise with me, begin, up, and down, raise up and down, good range of movement and down, up and down, up and down, up and down, swing phase coming in, up and down, and swing forwards and back, 
forwards and back, forwards and back, forwards and back, forwards and back, forwards and back. Class steady, hold, legs together, long sitting with me, ready? On your feet, up, running on the spot, with me, begin. Nice pace, keep it going, pressure on, that's good, keep it going. During this phase, we'll break into a five second countdown sprint, watch the screen and listen to the timings. Pick up a good pace. We're not jogging now, we're running. That's good, use your arms, stand by, go, five, four, three, two, one, and relax, keep the pace on, nice and steady, easy with the upper body, good, stand by, go, five, four, three, two, one, relax, keep the pace on, that's it, breathing rate has certainly increased, stand by, go, five, four, three, two, one, relax, keep the pressure on, Good. Stand by. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Normal jogging or running. Good. Keep it going. Work hard. Stand by. Last one. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Jogging. Easy enough slightly. That's good. All the way down, easing down, easing down. Next exercise is press ups, class steady, hold. Front prone position with me, down. Exercise with me, begin. Down and up, down and up, down and up. Keep your heels, hips, and shoulders in line. Down and up, down and up, down and up, down and up, down and hot, onto your knees, exercise with me, begin, down and push, 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 down and push. Down and push, down and push. Class steady, halt. Bring your hands towards your knees a little bit. Exercise with me, begin. Down and push, down and push, down and push. Work the arms. Down and push, push hard. Down and push, down and push, down and push. Down and push. Come on, last few. Down and push. Down and class steady, halt. In position for your next exercise. Back lying, knees bent, arms at your side. With me, ready. Arms out to the side. Exercise with me, begin. To the left and up. To the right and up. To the left and up and up, to the right and up, to the left and up, to the right and up, to the left and up, and down and up, and down and up, and down and up, and down and up, to the right and up, to the left and up, to the right and up and up, to the left and up, to the right and up, to the left and up, and down and up, and down and up, and down and up, and down and up, to the right and up, to the left and up, to the right and up, to the left and up, to the right and up, to the left and up, and down and up, 
and down and up, and down and up, and down and up. Class steady, hold. Long sitting, up, in position for your next exercise, alternate leg thrusts, with me, change. Exercise, with me, begin. Try and get your feet about 18 inches from your hands. Class steady, halt, feet together, on your feet, up. We are now ready to start the cool down and stretching exercise of level two. Follow the exercises with the class. The first exercise is in long sitting with your knees bent. In position with me, ready. Raise the hips up and go forward. Try and get your buttocks to your heels it doesn't matter if you can't, but feel the stretch in the shoulders. It must be a good stretch, but it must be comfortable. Hold the position. Your next exercise is designed to stretch the muscles at the backs of the legs. We need to be standing with our feet hip width apart. Come back into neutral and stand up. Exercise with me, begin. Run your hands down the front of your legs, bending your knees as you go down. Stop at the top of your socks and then extend the knees backwards nice and slowly, bringing your head down in between your shoulders. That's good. Hold the position. Slowly start to uncurl now to your knees, to your hips, to your shoulders and reach up. Bring your hands down into neutral, step out for a calf stretch. Good. Hold that position, feet flat, toes pointing forwards. Good support position. Keep the rear leg straight and both heels on the floor. Come back into neutral and step out with the other leg. Good stretch. The next exercise is designed to stretch the muscles on the front of the thigh. Come back into neutral, pick up one leg, bring in the heel to your buttock and extend at the hip. You might need some support during this exercise just so you can keep your balance. Come down into neutral, pick up the other leg, again heel to buttock and extend at the hip. Hold the position, the next exercise is designed to stretch the muscles on the inner part of the thigh. Come down into neutral, take a pace out each side with your feet and go down to the support position on one side. Good stretch with that straight leg. You'll feel it on the inner thigh. Come back, up into neutral and down the other side. The next exercise is a trunk stretching exercise. Come up into neutral, feet closer together, and rock over into a position of stretch. Well done, hold that position, good stretch position. Reach down for your socks, let the head curve with the body. Come up through neutral again, and down the other side. Come up into neutral and class steady hold. That concludes the exercise regime. I hope you've enjoyed following the program. And more to the point, I hope that it's put you on the road to a healthier and more active lifestyle.